All right, so the last time you were here, I threw you an engagement party. Do you want your money back? I want my money back. <laughs> I mean, I, I sent, like, you know, you enjoyed it. I you... should have kept one of those dudes' numbers. Yeah. That would have come yeah. handy now. <laughs> Now, is that like, is that an awkward thing that all this attention is going on and you're not with him anymore, or? It's not really as awkward, because I'm living in, and so I think people spend more time actually thinking about it than I really do, because I just believe that when a chapter is done, you have to close it and start that new one, and that's kind of where I am right now, is I felt like I have so much to be thankful for at this time that my energy hasn't really been focused on that, and mm -hmm. it's actually, I've been kind of impressed with people and how much they've actually shown more respect. I don't really I don't really look up anything, so maybe they haven't been showing respect, but from what I can from what I have like seen, I felt like people have really focused on my music right now when right. I've needed them to and have actually been really good about that. Because that's the only thing I worried about was I didn't want it to me to sacrifice what I've been working for for just the attention to be on that. Or to overshadow that. Yeah. And so did you good. write anything? Uh, is anything on this album about that? The whole that? album is a story of that. And I think it says that with starting with Adore You and ending with someone else's. I feel like you can really have find like this arc of like growth. And I didn't even know as much of one until I really listened to it now that it's done and I have like my physical copy and I put it in my car. I'm like, you know, this is really, this really is like telling a story. And I think I knew more intuitively what my life, where my life was going than right. I actually thought I did Yeah, at the I time. didn't want to read into it and assume that, but it does sound like that, starting with that Yeah, it's a real song. story, yeah. And are you, are you friendly? Do you speak, or? I, you know, for me, I haven't really gotten to see anyone right now, because I've been, like, so crazy busy. Mm -hmm. I'm just letting that chapter kind of close, and mm -hmm. then just looking forward to that new one. So right. I want to be really clear and determined with everything I'm doing in my life right now, and I have been. And I keep saying I'm the happiest I've ever been, and that's not even a dig. That's just me, because I really am genuinely happy, finally, with myself, which I think sometimes it takes you separating yourself from someone else to really be happy with who you are. I've never been able just to be alone, and I'm obsessed with being alone and, like, hearing my thoughts, because I'm... You I'm are right now? Someone. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm really obsessed with just, with, like, trying to... Everyone, you, you should give me a list, too. I've asked everyone that I kind of are, is around me. I'm like, give me a list of your favorite movies, your favorite books, your favorite artists, just so I can know more about the few people that I do have in my life and really know about them and really um, see what they're inspired by and also continue to just learn more, listen to every different I'm style gonna of music. I'm going to give you a list. I, I Please would love do, and I, I will. and I would love to get a list from you as well. I, I think that's a brilliant idea for Thank people you. to share. Let's and exchange. Say, I've been doing it a lot with even people that I just meet and different designers or anything. Like, what made you get inspired? And so I'm trying to take this alone time, the five minutes I do have a day. Yeah, I was <laughs> going to gonna say, there's not a lot of alone time. To learn time. as yeah. much as I can.